Burnley against Bournemouth with myself, Chris Temple, and the former Cherries defender, John Williams. Burnley, of course, in their claret shirts with sky blue sleeves and white shorts and socks. And Lowton already looking for Goodmanson down this right-hand side early on. He's got him behind Rico. The cross into the penalty area is headed away by Lerma. Comes back out to this right side once more. Lowton to swing an early cross in. Fast start this from the home side. And a shot low from Lennon is blocked away by Adam Smith. And in the first 20 seconds, two alarms. Here's Fraser now with a bit of space for the Cherries inside the Burnley half of the field. Wilson ahead of him. Fraser still going towards the edge of the area. Now he finds Wilson. Fraser wants it back. Wilson onto his right foot, comes back to Sermon, and his shot is blocked away. Then Rico went in firmly but comes off second best, and he's limping, and he's out of position. It's Vidra down the right-hand side. Poor first touch. Ake comes across. Vidra right out on the touchline, and then he's pulled Nathan Ake back, and the Cherries win a free kick there, and Rico is still hobbling his way back from the halfway line. Up to halfway, where Vokes wins the header. Sermon then there ahead of Vidra. Now it's Brooks in some space again for the Cherries here. It's halfway inside the Burnley half. They're letting him run here, David Brooks. And his ball towards the edge of the box is cut out by me, who gets himself in a tangle. And Brooks has it again. Over by the corner flag. Right-hand side for Bournemouth here. To the top of the box and Sermon. Laid into King. Nice link up. Fraser to pull the trigger. Good block, Tarkovsky. Wilson right-hand side still keeps it alive. Now Adam Smith, good bit of pressure this, and then Adam Smith gives it away to Ashley Westwood, and a chance for Vokes on the halfway line to hold it up. Support from Westwood, Vidra through the middle over the top, Rico, really important header. Great header, he was through on goal, if he hadn't got to the ball, and just knocked it down for Jefferson. Brooks is tracking back defensively and brings the ball out from the left, the right-hand side, rather. Now Sermon looking to lift Great one ball. over to Rico, over the halfway line, down this left-hand side. Rico cuts him field away from Lowton with ease. Now finds Fraser. Fraser to the edge of the box, shoots with his left foot, blocked by Tarkovsky. Loose ball runs for King, but he'll settle for the corner. Smith, though, right-hand side with his corner, short along the lines of Brooks. Back it goes to Smith. Then to the right corner of the box of Sermon. It's gone slightly awry, this one, but the Cherries have still got it. Fraser back out to Brooks again. They've managed to recover the situation. Brooks looking to cross, comes back to Smith. Back onto Brooks, doesn't want to take it on his right foot, really. Tries to get it on his stronger left. He's going towards the byline now. He will use his right foot in towards the six-yard box. Cleared away. Ake takes a nice touch to control it. Drives it for goal, looping towards the net. Off the bar and away. Vidra there to clear. Well, Ake's shot took a wicked deflection. It spun up in the air, came back off the bar. Sermon halfway inside the Burnley half to Fraser who takes it crisply now back to Brooks edge of the area space for David Brooks to whip one in too close to goalkeeper Hart all very tight on the halfway line to this right touch line Lerma got a foot in but it runs for Jack Cork who spreads it into space and Charlie Taylor left hand side Cherries have got sucked over to this side and space for Taylor to attack Deep to the back post towards Goodmanson. Rico heads it behind, backpedalling, and it's a Burnley corner. Into the near post. It goes right across everybody, and then it can't get out under his feet. Sam Vokes misses a golden opportunity. Steve Cook got half a block in, but Vokes should have done better before Cook was allowed to block. Bournemouth in possession now with King. Nice little turn away, 30 yards from the Burnley goal. King into the feet of Brooks, who's come over to this left-hand side. David Brooks goes past his man easily. Brooks for looking for the pullback into the six-yard box. Hart falls on it at the near post. Just too many claret shirts there. Nice bit of interplay, though, involving King and Brooks. Space here for Brooks. Terry's have got men forward. Wilson's in oceans. King right-hand side of the penalty here. Joshua King towards Wilson, who slides in and can't quite get there. Goodmanson by the corner flat, right-hand side, left foot ball whipped in, Sermon was brave back headling, knew he'd get clattered, which he did. Comes back out to court, back on, dazed and confused, but still lofts one in towards Vokes, who cushions it down, a shot goalwards from Westwood, the second time of asking, and then Vintra, and Burnley do lead. It's the first Premier League goal in the Burnley colours for Matteo Vintra.
They took a couple of stabs at it. Westwood had one and then two, and it broke for the Czech striker, Masej Vidra, and he's on the board for Burnley. Burnley threaten again, the ball to the back post, sliding in, it's 2-0! And it's Aaron Lennon! And that is such a disappointing goal to concede, it was a long hanging cross right across the penalty area, sailed over everybody, and Aaron Lennon, 5'5", five five, stole in unseen to slide it into the corner, and Burnley have struck twice in the space of three minutes here. Referee is Anthony Taylor. Officials are in black, and the ball is with Jefferson Lerma here for the Cherries. 30 yards out, who's going to shoot? Lerma! Oh, busy, rising. Joe Hart just pulled his hand out of the way at the last minute. Not far away from the no, Colombian. Not far away at all. He absolutely cracked it. Sermon on the halfway line now. Bit of space for David Brooks in the number 10 pocket here. Brooks away from Westwood, who clips him. Certainly yellow card for Westwood. Cynical clip from behind. Sermon or Fraser? 11 minutes into the second half. It is Fraser, and it's past the post. Lerma to Fraser, just outside the right corner of the area. Francis runs on ahead of him. Fraser into the edge of the box for King. Nice first touch, back to Fraser. Square for Lerma to hit it. Didn't strike it at all. forward it comes Wilson oh King little ball on now Brooks has got an opportunity King's got on ahead of him Wilson there too Brooks into the penalty area oh great save Joe Hart that could potentially be a match winning save from Joe Hart Brooks on his stronger left foot he had men square but he went himself as the defenders ran away from him and Joe Hart with a magnificent stop now Taylor Near left touchline, Lennon goes past Simon Francis with ease. Lennon to the byline, in towards the penalty spot, and the volley goal was just deflected off the post, and the game is put to bed by Ashley Barnes. First shot, took a hit off somebody, came back off the uprights, and a bit like the first goal when it broke for Burnley in the penalty area, this time Ashley Barnes was on target, and Bournemouth are done. Down the left-hand side, Ake. Can the Cherries get something on the sheet here for their long-travelling fans? Brooks into the penalty area and Jermaine Defoe squares it towards King. King's brought down, is he? There's a challenge from behind. It's a free kick outside the box for something. Jermaine Defoe's pointing, saying, well, we'll rather have the penalty, thanks, for Joshua King getting clattered. But the whistle has gone for an earlier offence on the edge of the penalty area. Eddie Howe's inquiring why they couldn't take the second offence rather than the first. Might throw one or two jitters through the stands at Turf Moor if Stanislas can do something with this. Right footed, beaten away by Hart. It was straight to the goalkeeper and he shoveled it away. Firmly hit though, that's in the corner, it's got a chance. Brooks still getting booed. And it comes left footed, poor cross from David Brooks that time and cleared by Burnley up towards halfway. Comes back to Fraser. Fraser plays one in, headed away, Tarkovsky. And now everybody of the Cherries has committed upfield. They've got a break on here, but Ashley Westwood didn't have the pace to make use of it. Lennon might have, though, as he chases on against Lerma, who's the only man back at the moment. Terry's getting other bodies back. Square to the box. Bonds! 4-0! It's turned into a tonking. 